So today, me and Keon from Key Vision <laughs> are going to be checking to see if my germophobia is well founded. This black light and this luminol, which when sprayed in a specific area reveals bodily fluids, things like blood and spunk. Blah, 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 Mark Rover, blah, 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 Rona. But the main question is, do you want somebody's butthole juice in your mouth? I don't know if I should say that. That's pretty nasty. <laughs> so let's go check it out. Before hitting places like McDonald's, Walmart, Target, random gas station, we decided to check out the outlet mall that we were already at. And seeing as most of the businesses were actually closed down, we figured we wouldn't see a lot of activity, or so we thought. All right, let's check out the let's check out the countertops real quick. I mean, that that could be soap. These are all locked, closed down. Can you see that? Is that coming up, showing on the camera? Nah. We got some more down there. Ugh. Somebody's fucking oh, yeah, on yes, there, yeah. bro. All right. What about the people that missed? Anybody missed the toilets? All right. Let's spray it with a little bit of luminol. Now let's now let's check it with the black one. Holy shit! Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Did you see that? Did you yeah. see all that? Yeah. Bro. What are these people doing in here, man? Yeah. Holy crap. Alright. Alright, let's get out of here before we catch some stuff. Seeing as we had just found an unbelievable amount of germs and presumably bodily fluids at a low traffic, mostly closed off public restroom, we figured we'd make the next stop at a much higher traffic area, a McDonald's right off the main highway. So we're at McDonald's. Right now we're gonna go check out the bathrooms here and see if we can find any bodily fluids. We're at the, we're at the McDonald's bathroom right now. We're gonna check this out, see if there's anything. Look at that toilet. Nothing. What about the wall? How the people that missed? Spray the luminol. Spray that luminol. Mm -hmm. Just spray it out over the general area. Yo. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> what the actual fuck? Bro, Dang, this is why. Yeah. This is why I don't use public bathrooms. Unless I'm like peeing on the wall. What about the mirror? Alright, put the light on it. Dude, disgusting, that is, oh my God, bro. Dang, Man, that's, that's some, that's somebody's spunk <laughs> right there. Look, look under the, look under there. Uh, oh my God, bro. That's nasty. Here, let's try the door handle. There ain't nothing on the door handle. All right, now let's spray it with luminol. Bro, 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 see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Oh no, <laughs> I got, no, I'm infected. The McDonald's, you need, you need to step it up, McDonald's. What do you think, Keon? McDonald's needs to step it up? Next, we decided to hit up one of the places I thought was gonna be one of the dirtiest, but surprisingly turned out to be one of the cleanest, a random gas station. Now we're at a Sitco gas station. I got the key. She doesn't know we're doing this, so we gotta be quick. Right, right. Oh my lord. Get up close on that thing. See anything? I think we're good. Yeah. It's actually pretty, it's pretty clean. It's actually pretty clean for a Maybe just nobody uses it. Right. What about the sink right here? Nothing. Wow. That's pretty amazing. That's crazy. Let's check out this door handle. A little bit of funk. That could just be like rust yeah, and stuff a though. Bit. Now for the luminol. Spray that. Now let's check it out. Ah, there it is. 
That is crazy. Look at that, bro. Yeah, I would never trust public bathrooms again, man. No, man. <laughs> this is why I don't go to the bathroom in public. This is uh, nasty, dude. Look at this. Look at that. Yeah. That's somebody's, like, butthole stuff, bro. <laughs> Look, they blasted it all over the back of the toilet, man. <laughs> you see that? <laughs> it like came let me see it came it came back up you know like <laughs> dang here look at a wall it even got it on a wall yeah. some nasty mother oh my god bro <laughs> this is why i don't use public bathrooms you know what i'm saying like <laughs> seeing these surfaces covered in this glowy substance is presumably germs it made me wonder how much these large corporations like Target, Walmart, McDonald's actually did to slow the spread of the virus in their facilities. Hey, quit licking my foot. Or do their efforts stop at solely requiring people to wear masks to shop? So, McDonald's, nasty. Mini mall, nasty. Gas station, kind of nasty. McDonald's was worse. Let's, let's go to the next spot. Since I'm right next to it, I'm gonna check out the gas pump. It didn't show anything on the gas pump, but it was also in broad daylight. Most of these bathrooms that we were in were very low light or we were able to turn off some of the lights. So the next spot we decided to hit in our journey of nastiness is a place that pretty much everyone has been to at some point, Target. We're gonna go in Target. Yeah, we don't wanna get caught. So we're just gonna use the phone. So uh, yeah, hopefully it's okay quality. Restrooms at Target. Anything? A little bit. A little bit, yeah. A little bit, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. Now we're gonna spray the luminol. All right. Spraying everything. Let it sit for a minute. All right. Now let's see what it looks like. Yo. Oh my Whoa. God, bro. Look at it. It's everywhere. It is legit everywhere, dude. That is disgusting. <laughs> no more public bathrooms for me. Hell no, dude. Look at that. It's like it's fresh. Look at that. Look. Ah. Bro. We're like stepping in it, dude. Freaking stepping in it. Like somebody was standing like this and sprayed it. <laughs> I feel like I'm like covered in that. Whatever that is, it's pretty nasty. It's unacceptable right here. This is disgusting. And look, you wouldn't even know. You can't see nothing. Without the light. Without the luminol so and the never, light. So whenever you go use public bathrooms, make sure you get you a light. Yeah. You got to. Bring one of them lights. Got to. I'm stepping all You're in. You're stepping all in somebody's spunk. Hey, look at the, look at the bathroom. We'll look at the toilet one more time. Yeah, oh man. my God, dude. That's crazy. Yeah, I got to invest in one of these. <laughs> really. And some bleach. I feel like it's important to mention that there's a good chance that some of these splotches and spots are some sort of cleaner or something other than just human bodily fluids. Though we do know that luminol reacts with specific substances like blood and urine, semen, etc. Which is why crime scene investigators use luminol to find trace amounts of bodily fluids and you may have seen it used on your favorite TV show like CSI or Dexter. So far we had seen multiple people come in, use the restroom and then leave without even washing their hands. not even a rinse, and then proceed to push their shopping carts, pick up items around the store, and check out using cash or a credit card on a touchscreen credit card swipe machine. Knowing just how quickly germs spread exponentially from person to person, covering a very wide area in a very short period of time, I think it's safe to assume that every surface in this place at some point comes into contact with the virus or germs of some kind, most likely from someone's nether regions. Yuck. All over the place. Just I don't know how much longer I can stay in this. You wanna check your shoes? Here. Let's see your hands. Yeah, your hands ain't too bad. You're good, you're good. What about your shoes? What is that on my shoes, though? You good? 
<laughs> yeah, you got some on your shoes, bro. Here, let's see my hand. I'm all right, I'm all right. All right, we gotta get out of here. That's, that's nasty. That's enough disgust we've seen already. That's more than enough. We, we know it's nasty in there. We don't need to. Oh, let me put them on mask. Like it matters. I got somebody spunk all over my hands right now. So you want to check out the shopping carts? Yeah, the shopping cart be a good Because you know, a lot of people test the shopping cart and they just, you know, sometimes they have food or something in their cart and go to eat McDonald's after they shop or whatever. Yeah. You know? Yeah. That's true. So we'll probably find some butt juice on these carts. <laughs> yeah, we're making a video. Yeah, we just started that. No cat. <laughs> yeah. 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 Hey, go, go subscribe. I think we're good. Yeah, no, we're good. Spray my luminol. Yep. Somebody peeing on the carts. Can't wait to go to the bathroom, so. <laughs> Bring your wet wipes with you. There's a whole bunch of pee in this. Bro, you think that lady knows? She got pee she on her hands? No idea. But they have no idea. <laughs> Literally have no clue. Look, there's another one right there. Yeah, they have no, they After literally have today, no idea. I really I really see the importance of hand sanitizer. Now. Yeah, they, that's nasty. Yeah. And they got hand sanitizer in the things yeah, for the carts. Yeah, I know, I know. And they're still covered in pee. Our final stop was at a place that's known for having the highest level of cleanliness and only attracting the top 1% of the population. Yes, we are venturing into unknown territory, into uncharted waters, and to the depths of the nasty Walmart, where the Walmart people are. Out of order. Everything's out of order, yeah. All right, so we're at Walmart. We're at Walmart. Oh, man, all right. No, this, is gonna, this, is gonna, this is gonna be bad. Yeah, this is gonna be really bad. Like, you know, nobody use, like to use the bathroom at Walmart. Like, nobody. Yeah, nobody uses it because they know it's nasty. Right. Yeah, yeah, all right, good. Well, you, you can do it since. <laughs> <That's good. laughs> all right, all right. All right, let me check out the sinks. Nothing, nothing. Mm -hmm. Let's go check out the bathroom stalls. So all that yellow right there. That's nasty. That's gonna show up with the woman off. Alright, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Right, we're okay. Gonna be terrible. There's some poop on there. Oh, man, man. <laughs> man, this guy. This is the poop. <laughs> here comes the here comes the luminol. Alright, let's spray this luminol. Here we go. Spray over here. Spray it all in there. All right, spray right here. And this thing's empty. Empty. All right. So we're all sprayed up with luminol. Some old man just just touched the stuff and didn't even wash his hands. Yeah, wasn't washed. Didn't even wash his hands. So we know yeah. some of that some of that dick is making it to the handles. All right, here we go. We're all luminol up. Yo, uh, there it is. Yo, there, there it is. is. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Bro, somebody is peeing on the top of this urinal. It's Walmart, man. Look at that. Look at this over here. All down there. You can smell it. Smells. You smell it? I ain't trying to smell it. Smells like. I got this mask on. All right, here we go. I don't even want to go that far. Yeah, yeah look at it. that. You see it? Yeah. Look at that, bro. It is literally the entire toilet. It goes up the wall. Oh, it stinks, dude. Do you think it stinks because, because we know it's there now? I think it stinks because it's warm on the Everyone knows that Walmart's bathrooms are gonna be disgusting. We all knew that, there's no surprise there. I mean, you may as well have these cows going in the bathrooms at Walmart and Target. There's really not a whole lot of difference. Okay, here comes the last, the last stall. All right, you check out that, check out that last stall, man. 
See what kind of nasty poo poo we got here. Yo, look, look at that. Uh, you can see it in the toilet. Uh, <laughs> what is that? Bro, what is that? It's time to go back. Look, wait, look over here. Look right up in there in the corner. <laughs> look at that, dude. The handrail. Is it on the handrail? Yep. Look at uh, this. Dude, somebody is just like straight up just. <laughs> <laughs> I think I had enough of this. Uh, yeah. I got a shower, man. Yeah, alright, so we're gonna go take showers because something's wrong with that. Hey, this guy works, but we can't record so. Right as we were leaving, I noticed a Walmart employee walk into the bathroom, presumably to see what we were doing, meaning that someone in that bathroom had gone and ratted us out to the staff. Probably the guy who didn't wash his hands after urinating. I was going to ask him right then and there why the bathrooms were so unbelievably disgusting at Walmart, but then I remembered that it's actually an invasion of privacy to film somebody in a bathroom, which is why we took every precaution to make sure that no one else wound up getting recorded while we were making this video. Walmart is disgusting. That's why I don't use the bathroom at Walmart. No, I don't be using the bathroom there either. And I wanted to give a special shout out to Keon from Key Vision for joining me in this journey of nastiness and allowing me to expose him to some potentially harmful bacteria. And I'll link one of Keon's videos as well. It's actually a pretty funny prank video that you guys can go check out. If you do like this video and you want me to make more like these or possibly a part two, like, share, and leave a comment below so I know that you enjoyed the video. So make sure you have hand sanitizer on you at all times, wear your mask, and don't go on a public toilet unless you're literally about to explode. So basically what I've learned is more or less what I've expected. Short of pressure washing the entire facility with bleach every 10 minutes, there's absolutely no way you're gonna avoid coming into contact with someone's bacteria from their genital regions. You wanna be in a video? Moo once for yes. Should I get the consent forms? And I also wanna thank these cows because why not? <laughs>